Good evening. How you doing? It's our team maker, and this is more commandos too. See? See how they're done, 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 done. And we're continuing from where we left off. I'm trying to save Private Smith. Now, as a quick catch-up. Alright, as a quick catch-up. We have got our crew back together. We are on the bridge. And we are needing to take out the ones surrounding the uh, the help here. So we can actually get in and get him health and get him to the radio. So that is what we're going to do tonight. But I have ready? a feeling it's not going to be as straightforward as we first think. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Leave it to me. Okay. Because as you can see, there's guys running all over the place around here. He's keeping an eye on them. He's there keeping an eye on them. That's a bad guy there that we, we're going to have to try and take out. Right away, sir. But I'm going to try and take these three out first. Because we're only taking that guy out, so. Piece of cake. Mine. Good. Sorry, don't do it that way. <laughs> okay. I'm ready. Piece of cake. I mean, we kind of do, but we kind of don't, you know. Uh, I'm not bad. How are you? Right away, sir. Aha. Aha. Okay. <clears throat> Where was that coming from? Because they never showed up before. That's not good. I hope you recover soon, mate. That's not good. Uh huh. I ran out of grenades. Oh, I did. Let's go. You're down there, yeah. yeah. We leave you there. I like that. Ah! 
I have no idea who's that, who that is. Who is it shooting me from there? Oh, I think I know. I think I know. I'm ready. <laughs> yeah, I remember over the past few weeks we've been very excited to try and see it. Piece of cake. It's him. Leave it to me. Piece of cake. Okay. Uh huh. Right. Okay. So let's see what the situation is here. Because all I've got to do at the moment, as far as I'm aware, is get in, get get him healed, bring him out down into the radio bit over here. Kelly's heroes. Now there's a, there's a there's a call back to an old movie. Clint Eastwood. Good choice, Colonel. I'll keep this yes. up, bugger. I like this. Anybody I can hit. Uh huh. Oh, it's him. Ah! It's him. That's who that is. Right. Yeah, they seem to be your bag. Which is cool. Everybody should have one. Now I know who it is. Now I can deal with you. It's about time. <laughs> Currently watching World War Two in real time. <laughs> See, I, I've had my granddad's like war diary. I like that. Uh huh. Okay. Not the most pleasant of reads, I may say. I see. Right, I've killed him off. That's a good thing. Hmm. I see. Controller was working on on this after a fashion. I see. Okay, who was that? On here, but 
yeah, no, there was a couple of buttons that just weren't linked to it properly. So that's why I've gone back to using mouse and keyboard on this. Again, somewhere, it was him. You, you little bastard. So him, right, okay, so I like that. Done. See, I don't have any more grenades. If I had more grenades, that'd be perfect. Done. How are we going to do this? I like that. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. What's the next target? Uh-huh. Ha-ha! <laughs> okay. I see. All right. I like this. What's the next target? Yeah, it was it was weird because he was on the um He, he was on the, the actual evacuations before the D-Day landings happened and then he went into uh, Africa as a desert rat. No doubt. That's an amount of bullets there. Uh huh. So now we've got F. Crystal clear. He's dead. I didn't really expect any more to be up here, but of course, why wouldn't there be? Because now I just have to try. I mean, if they're getting killed off by these guys, even better. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because there was a part in it where he said that he was wait. They had to lie on the harbours. They had to lie down on the harbours because of the, bom the bombings. And one of the ships he managed to get on was, was sunk. He was rescued and the second boat was sunk. <laughs> because when he was part of the Desert Rats, he was transporting the petrol, the fuel. Okay. Because it's also how I found out they had concentration camps in Africa. Because he walked through one of them after towards the end of it and it's just like oh very chilling I like that all right sadly you passed away before I was born ha <laughs> ha 
Okay. Crystal clear. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. All right. language in some in some of the bits so it was just a bit um <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay let's just say he wouldn't get away with it now put it that way yes i mean he died i think it was like the 60s he, he my, okay. my granddad passed away unfortunately crystal clear All right. Crystal clear. Done. Oh, now you come up. Now you come up. Thank you What's very much. What's the next target? Streamy stream labs. Yeah, thank you. Uh huh. All right. Done. It's a guy there. Done. No doubt. I just realised I was doing a lot there without saving it. I have a feeling we may have to get off the, the area here, around here, so I might as Done. well do this while I'm here, right? <laughs> no doubt. Okay. Just do that, just in case. Right. Done. I keep thinking he says dung rather than done. Honestly, couldn't tell like you. Um, I mean, you could ask our, our, our friend Corn. He knows a lot about that stuff. Uh huh. I see. Okay. Crystal clear. All right. Crystal clear. That other guy's coming in. If I can go round, then. 
and take these guys out, then I can go and get these other three. What's the next target? You are a raider. Legendary. Maelstrom Alpha, hello. Thank you very much for the raid, dude. No doubt. Yeah, it's going more malicious. 24 viewers. Hello, good sirs. And good madams. And good ladies. And good gents. How was the rest of Hi Hira Hero? <laughs> I mean, you're joining me as I'm trying to save Private Smith. As I'm getting to shoot Jerry. Clown man has put up the cape. Retired for now, but the game is very silly. <laughs> oh, so so it was good, just not not great to uh, carry on with, which is fair enough. Link between worlds, next thing. Very cool. Very cool indeed. The game I have never played. It was just a silly game I wanted to show people because it's very obscure. I tell you what it looked it put me in the mind of it. It put me in the mind of inspiration for Shenmue and then the Yakuza games of the way it was structured. Which again, not normally a bad thing. But I could see how, you know, you get bored you could get bored of it very quickly. Yes. Well, you run into Sunny Jim Jim. Of course not. <laughs> yeah, you take that. <laughs> I mean, if he wants to do something silly like that... <laughs> right. Done. Oh, my God. Look at the water effects there. Look at that. Yeah, with Mark Hamill as um, Majima. Here's something for you, right? How goes this? Um, it is and it isn't. I mean, I have been doing missions in like two streams, so that's not been bad. There has been a lot of good progress, but there's still some absolute bullshit with it, you know? I mean, I'm on... I've got two more missions to do after this before number two is finished. And then I've got number three, Tar start and go through. What's the next target? So, you know, it's not bad. It's not horrible. But any stretch of the imagination. Ha -ha. <laughs> that was very silly of him. Yes. Yeah, I haven't been round... Um, oh, Oh, thank you for the follow bits. Thank you very, very much for the follow. I hope you're doing well. But yeah, funny story about um, all right, Yakuza's. I had uh -huh. right. I had the ori the original on PS2. Oh, you did shot dead bastard. I had the original on PS2. I got the um, remastered Kiwamis, right? So I didn't need it anymore. So I sold it off. And this is a game, right, that I went into sex with. When I sold it, the person I sold, I sold it to was younger than the game. And I remember putting this on Twitter and someone I knew decided they were going to be a dick about it and went, oh no, you should have done that, how dare you? Very dare I indeed. You play my favourite game franchise, so here I am. Oh, fantastic. It is part of the I other like games this. I play as well. Yeah, how could I, my monster? And I went, look, that's, I, I, you know, that's not an appropriate thing to say. And he, he couldn't be, he couldn't, he couldn't fathom why. And he said, well, it's your fault, you did it. Block. <laughs> 
Exactly, Abdullah. Exactly. I like that. And then he went up to our friend Tom, who you may have met at um, Res a few years ago. I which like is a major this. no no. You don't go to someone else and go, why did someone block me? No. That'd be very naughty. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> Sadly, the world is full of them. Yes. Right, you're losing health. Get yourself some health. Dung. Is he saying dung? Because it sounds like he's saying dung. <laughs> it's like he's going dung. Excuse me, where are you going? I'm ready, sir. Aha. <laughs> but no, bad. <laughs> it did sound like he was going bad. Right now, if I move him away, down sir. to here. Hold on. Don't right okay. away, sir. I don't want you here. I want you there. Right. Me? Yes. Yes, you. I want you. Hmm. All right. To not do that because that was very silly. Okay. I wanted you to go around this way round and shoot him that way from the side, but hey. I like this. Okay then, if that's the way you want to play it. Hmm. Crystal clear. Now these guys here are the um, the allies, and Smith is in here, so we have to get to him, but not use all our health packs. I like that. Ha ha! All right. Watch you. I like that. Okay. Okay, so that's the ones around the immediate church taken care of for them. I see. Right, now I'm out of bullets mm. for that. Okay. Do with more. I could do with a lot more, but there you go. I like that. Right, so that's him dead, that's him dead, that's these guys now need to die, so So these guys need to die, and then these three need to go, because there's one behind the swings here. Right, okay, so what I'm thinking. Machine guns on the heads of elephants. That sounds like a far cry thing. Right, there's, there's stuff in there. We need to get. I like that. Crystal clear. I mean, it's smart strategy. I mean, if only, you know, Hannibal had them when he was coming over the Alps. What's the next target? Because you know the Romans misheard him. 
heard them at first, right? When they said about the, the Hannibal coming over the Alps with the elephants. Because he thought they said they're in their element. This is not wanting to come up. So I like that. Unless I need to be on that level, but I don't think so. Done. Right. I hate that, that sometimes it All glitches right. out with that. Oh. Right, you. Come with me. Right away, sir. We're going to do some stealthy, stealthy killing bollocks right here. You're going to like this. This is just going to be some great stealthy killing bollocks. This is mine. Mine. This is, this is mine. Mine. Because I can pass them back to that guy. Oh, there's sniper bullets as well. I can pass them over to him. Ooh. Even better. Because we've even got some sniper stuff. See, this is when the game becomes really good. Moments like this. A lot of people lose to Roman. Good. Did you see what I did there? <laughs> I've heard the WWE joke. <laughs> uh -huh. right. By the way, how's Final Fantasy VII Rebirth? Okay. I'm looking forward to playing that once I win an Good. NBA championship. Four streams right in the room, sunk 28 hours into it. Bloody hell. I mean, that's the reason I haven't been in your in your streams as much, is because I just don't want spoilers. Right away, sir. Which I know you'll understand perfectly. No. because, you know, he won't say no to those. Speaking of Japanese RPG games, okay, go for it. What, 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 we, what, we, what we thinking? Uh, you can have more of those. Uh -huh. Wait, they, why would they remove it if they're going to bring the expansion out? Unless they're doing some sort of um, digital deal. Right away, sir. Agreed. That 
wants it. Oh yeah, I know all about Lost Judgment. <laughs> that franchise uh -huh. is my bag. Moin. It's a weird censorship. And how quiet it sounds now. Okay. So these three fuckers now. Piece of cake. Let's take these three buggers out now uh -huh. before. Okay. Before we go into the into the uh -huh. church here, right? You me? come with me because I want you. I mean, if we play our cards right and nothing untowards happens here, right? Because we never know. We never know what else is going to appear. We could, in theory... We like theory because everything works in theory. Beyond to Castle Colditz tonight. No doubt. Crystal clear. All right. That's the main game. Crystal clear. That's not the DLC. All right. know this because I remember distinctly playing about it because that's the main story arc of the game but again not going to say anything else about what happens in that story arc because there are people in here that may want to play it and I think they should play it yes done I like that. Don't think so. Done. Crystal clear. Well, yeah, you've also got thing made the Sega bit. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Because I did a check of, of, of how far I am into um, Like a Dragon, Infinite Wealth. I was not playing the Don Do Do Dokun Island fully. I am about 97 hours in. <laughs> I've almost finished it, so it'll probably be around about 120 hours. And I've also noticed, I don't know whether you noticed this when playing um, Devil May Cry 2 Mel. Devil May Cry 2, the Lucia story, is actually smaller than the Dante one. I like this. All right. About halfway through it. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Crystal clear. Yeah, oh yeah. The pound mate stuff is brilliant. Hmm. Ha ha. Okay. Good night, sweet prince. Done. Blink. 
Yep. <laughs> An Elden Ring DLC. Oh, God, yeah. Okay. Now, I'll give you the offer the same one I give to, like, Reese's Wave and All my right. brother and Kamikaze Kitten. If you want to co-op, I have no problem doing that. <laughs> where are where? I mean, obviously, you've got, you know, the other Vikings of Twitch as well. Let's go. Yeah, so many long games. I'm actually kind of glad that uh, with the D the Devil May Cry, they're smaller because starting Sunday, I'm playing the original Benedi. I love I loved what I played of it. I only Stay played up to way. like chapter ten on the PS3. Because I got to like the, the boss rush level. This is the place, isn't it? It is the place, so we have to try and get down into there. Okay, so... Do I need the thief to unlock this, or to the, will the guys open oh, it no, for wait, us? Sir. I haven't. Um, I know people that Understood. have. We have our... My co-hosts on the, the Game One Play Itself, which is on, on Sundays now, on the podcast, or... On your listening devices. Cheap plug. I'm ready, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna need the thief now to unlock the door, aren't I? Yeah, only summon you spirit ashes are in a boss, yeah. So I used to be that way, and then I'd thought bugger it, why not? That's it. Yeah, I'm gonna need the bloody thief. Aha. Uh -huh. Fine. Me? Yes. Come on then, thief. We need you. Okay. You'll need the thief to unlock the door. It's a pity he can't look in there, even though I think that's because Quick, it's glitched. Wasn't it? Tell me. Right, here the door we go. Going. <laughs> yeah. Oh, believe me, I know that all too well, the stub and pride bit, but... It got past a certain point where I went, I just can't be asked in stub and pride. <laughs> At times of some of it, it's like, right, yep. yeah. We're a Souls game. It's a lot more fun just doing it with co-op, so... Because there was a series that uh -huh. Tom Marrett did on his bit when playing through things like Dark Souls called Asshole Mates. Okay. Now, why can I not get in? Do I have to walk I around for this. into here? Oh, wait, wrong bit, wrong bit. And talk to these guys. Already there. And why aren't these guys talking to us? Because they're our allies, right? Already there. Going. Hmm. Going there. Is that won't let us in. Send the big guy to scan him, that's fine. I'm okay. ready, sir. But they're our allies, why would they be scared? Uh 
It was a good idea. Good. Good. Do I have to go in there? Is that it? Is there a hole in there? Okay. Aha. Choice, Colonel. There's no way to climb. Okay. No way down into there. Already there. But that's where he's in, because we've got to get into here somehow. There. Think I see the way. Time. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Fuck. Going there. <sighs> okay. Give me these, mate. Thank you very much. Because the guy needs healing, right? So what's the one thing I need to take with me that yes. would help him heal? Oh yeah, a medikit. That's right. <laughs> Good idea, I suppose. Already there. Telling me maybe shit's about to go down. Going there. Yes. Yes. Okay, so I gave him the health. So what am I supposed to do? Oh, wait, I know what I'm supposed to do, for God's sake, lad, stupid. Time. There you go. Already there. Yes, sir. Now, that's done, sir. Before I use the radio, I'm going to put my yes. guys inside the church. Yes. Because I have a feeling we're going to need to defend something. Now it's time to save Tom Hanks. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, he looks pretty bloody safe at the moment. That's done, sir. Oh, what are you doing, lad, every time? Well? Well? You are a raider. At your service, Legendary. sir. Legendary. Corn, how you doing, man? Welcome on in, good sir. Actually, I better take someone with him because otherwise they're not going to get there, are they? That's actually a really better idea. Yeah. Tell me. Actually, no, leave, right, so leave the thief here. Yep. Because then the, these guys can, you know, be at doors and stuff and start shooting shit. Sigh! 
It's actually not going too bad, mate. How are you? Are you ready, sir? Are you... Are you ready? Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. I mean, we've, we've got Private Smith okay. now, not Ryan. Me? Yes, you. Uh huh. All ready to go. Ooh, another platinum to the pocket. Very cool. All ready, sir. I just have Let's a feeling we're going to have to defend something here, and it's like, no, I want to get out the fuck out of Dodge. Unless, of right course, away. I already did that when the uh, thingies there were defending against those troopers. But you never know. <laughs> yeah. Bling, bling. Oh, no, wait. I mean, oh, for God's sure. sake, lad, stop pressing the Windows button. Let's go. <laughs> Not yet, no. Because I say, I don't know whether it's thing me. I don't know what's going to happen next, and I'd rather have it surprised on me. At your service. At your I'm glad to hear you're well. Yeah, kill enemies before I kill you. Yeah. Because there, as well, you would have given me a tip for no reason. Because I completed the mission. Mission's done. Private Smith looks like so. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> kill enemies before they kill you. If they are shooting you, make sure you have enough health. Okay, why, how did they change the level then? Because I've, I've completed it, so I might as well... Might as well hear this one. How have they, com how have they changed the level? Before we go on and continue and go to Castle Colditz. Where they're supposed to be defending shit. Where he's supposed to be defending shit while he's on the blower. I mean, you can spoil the level now. I've just finished it, you know. Unless it's the bonus mission you're thinking about. Because don't forget, you, you can have bonus missions, which might be the next bit to it. Because if you're watching my playthrough from last week, when I got onto the carrier... <laughs> yeah, I know, it's crazy, isn't it? Then there was a the bit where you had to go around the carrier as a bonus part of the level. So that might be why you're saying they changed it. Because I, you know those little books you can collect? I didn't collect all of them. There was about three bits of uh, ones I didn't get. In a small town in eastern Germany, on the top of a hill surrounded by the river Mulde, rises the most impregnable fortress of the Third Reich, Golditz Castle. Now converted into a prison, it houses, as well as some high-ranking military personnel, those Allied prisoners who have tried to escape from other camps. Golditz is considered by the Germans a Zonderlager, a maximum security prison. Golditz is the pride of the German penitentiary system, reputedly escape proof. For the Allied prisoners, the only way to leave Golditz. Two is missions down. left, apart from any bonus bits. Because that will make sense if it was a Born bonus mission. Position. Or a bonus part of it. Who in position? 
Should I got a driver? You can say it now, yeah, I passed it. Three in position. Four in position. Okay, guys. Remember the ones inside the castle. We mustn't set off the alarm or they'll kill our comrade. We have to get the three parts of the secret plan he was trying to steal which led to his capture. Okay. The plan is encoded in three different parts. First, there is an encrypted document which is in Major General Rudolph's possession. It comprises several sheets filled with numbers that appear to mean nothing. Secondly, the code template has been hidden by General Heinz. It is a template sheet with holes punched into it. It will only display the numbers of interest when placed over the encrypted document. Finally, we need the code book to decipher the text of the plan. It is kept by Field Marshal Desfell. Remember that if we set off the alarm, they will not only kill our friend, but will also destroy all the documents. Okay, men. If we ever needed perfection, it's today more than ever before. This is what we do. Let's do it for our friend. <laughs> yeah, if we ever need protect, uh, perfection, <laughs> you're saying that about me on this. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's not going to go well, is it? Right, let's <laughs> first of all save it. Now, also bear in mind, big messages I can't read at the moment because of there. Because I only have a small bit. It's about that much of a window to see. Because I've got my OBS. Yeah, incoming paragraph. <laughs> well, you see, what you were supposed to do is there was supposed to be tanks coming in from here, 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 and here. When you use the radio, the general tells you gen German reinforcements are headed to your position, and you have to hold out until help arrives. Tanks and lots of German soldiers swarm your position. See, I think, and I will be checking this later. Not because I don't believe you, because I've been watching it to see how well and how far I am in terms of, you know, position of how much of missions I have left and stuff. Is, um, there was, as I say, there was one that was on the air, the aircraft carrier that we did last week. And the, the bonus mission was on the actual aircraft carrier having to take them out before the bombs happened, before they were bombed. <laughs> Why would German soldiers ever listen to a spy with obviously a French accent? <laughs> well, so we have three positions here, here, and here, and we have to go to here and here. So, rescue the thief from a certain death without setting off the alarm. There's no Allens. <laughs> They're like brilliant French dicks. They almost were given Paris as a present. Yes, I went there. <laughs> yeah, so Templar, uh, the template has been hidden. <laughs> this book is kept by Field Marshal Bethel. The encrypted plan. Right, so we have to kill a couple of major uh, generals and marshals and Mr. Beans there. Mr. Heinz Beans. So. How are we going to do this one? Now we do have a disguise man, so we could we do have a soldier that can walk walk around, which is nice. The driver's probably gonna get out on that, maybe. Because we do have a driver, so we're escaping via vehicle. Which is probably over here. Now we have Mr. Sniper Pants here. What's Mr. Sniper Pants bringing to the party? So they're covered. How do you unlock the bonus missions? Well, there's some red books. Do you see this? Yeah, see where I'm here? Where I'm hold, um, using the mouse bit here. You have to basically make a full picture in this for each level. 
if you do that you unlock the bonus mission which I have a feeling that's what you were referring to because if you got all the, all those it would make the picture up and that's what unlocks it the extra bit okay I like this you don't have a knife do you Done. I want to try and take him out as secretly as possible. This is a house there. So he's there then. I mean, he's got a hard enough job as that is. Yeah. There's Mr. Driver. How's he getting over? I can imagine. Mr. Driver, do you carry a knife? You don't, but you do carry molotovs. Ooh. And a tripwire. But you gotta be careful because if he goes by certain parts, he can see down here. So that's the vehicle we're gonna be getting out of. Of the area we're right. Okay, so. I guess that's the church of one of the, the coaches in. We're going to use a Molotov there to kill all those. So probably get him killed first and then do those so we, can, we our guy can escape from that. This is daunting. Much bigger than porridge. Well, where are you and how do we see you, so... Right. So what first? Because he. Yeah. Oh. We. Oui. So where are you? Okay. So there's a thief there. Okay. Right, so that bit's in there. Again, so okay, so that's in that building there. Okay, so there's the, the bits are actually in the main cold, it's castle. Okay. At your service. So why am I in here? Why have you put me in here? That was easy. Right, so, so you're in the church. Huh? I think we're going to have to try... <laughs> yeah, probably. I know I haven't actually started moving yet. I just want to make Object. sure I'm doing everything correct. You know? Because I've got these guys over here. Piece of cake. Go right away, sir. Go 
Right away, sir. Piece of cake. Before I try anything, I was going to say that. What's <laughs> going on there? I want to try this. This is mine. It's not that way. <laughs> Again, anything sort of like war stuff like that, chances are I haven't. Then again, then again, have you seen it, Corn? Have you seen it every day in chat? Yeah. See, that didn't work. <laughs> I mean, we've got to experiment now, haven't we? Yeah, luckily we have a time machine guest. Balls, okay. You are a raider, legendary. And welcome on in for the third raid this evening. How's it going, dude? Piece of cake. Aha. 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 <laughs> yeah, you're really spoiling him. I know. <laughs> it's great, isn't it? <laughs> this is mine. Okay. Good. TV sees that he doesn't. See, ideally, I need Done. I need a packet of cigarettes. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. She got hundred percent. Not hundred percent feeling it. Yeah. Uh, hello? <laughs> that wasn't going to go well either way, was it? <laughs> so we have to find our way in. This is going to be brutal. Piece of cake. Aha. Piece of cake. Aha. Okay. <laughs> yes, a piece of cake about you. <laughs> Aha. Uh -huh. uh, right. Okay. So it wouldn't let me do the setting it off when I'm buried myself.
piece of cake. Aha. Maybe I don't take those guys out just yet. Piece of cake. Maybe I do, but I have to be a bit sneaky with this, you know. Piece of cake. Fine. Okay. Moin. Aha. Moin. Aha. Bollocks. I started running. Didn't want to run. The idea is there that what I'm going to do is he set here, set that off, go round behind him, kill him while he he's behind that, you know, behind that greenhouse. Piece of cake. Aha. It will be done. <laughs> Aha. It's going to take me a minute or two, but it will be done. And we're going to get ourselves Good. a little bit into this tonight. Okay. Because we've got 50 minutes to not completely fuck up. Aha. Good. Okay. Aha. Ah! <clears throat> See, that's when I have to stand up and go. But you, you, you get my idea, right? You, you see, you see the idea forming in my head. Piece of cake. Aha. Aha. Good. Okay. No worries, dude. Thank you uh -huh. very much for bringing your raid in, mate. And I shall catch you next time. Aha. Okay. Agreed. Hey, look, it worked. Mine. Right, need to pass that to me old mucker over there, right? We got a kill. We've made a star. <laughs> We're further on than we thought. <laughs> Agreed. He didn't have any cigarettes, the bastards. Away, sir. Aha. 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 <laughs> yeah, that went a bit wrong, that bit, didn't it? <laughs> Whoops. All right.
Okay. 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 It's okay. Piece of cake. It's okay. Where he is, it's okay. I should put this bit round here. So they hear it. Piece of cake. Not yet, though. Not yet. It turns around again. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Moin. So I need to get this guy to the church so we can give him a uniform. I think the sniper is going to take him out. But the sniper is going to have to take him out as well as him. And go on the bridge there. So I think him as well. Leave it to me. Done. Aha. Uh -huh. Can work with this, that's fine. We, we, you know, we're not. Piece of cake. This seems like doo doo. <laughs> uh -huh. so this is one of those moments that make you go, Oh, why did you do that? Other times, nine times out of ten, it won't do. Don't the cake. bugger like it. Piece of cake. Moin. Okay. Aha. Hey, all I'll say is that, you know, we'll keep this as positive. We're one death closer to winning this, this level. We're one death closer to winning this game and going on to Commando 3. This is mine. Good. <laughs> uh huh. I heard that. Okay. Piece of cake. Okay. Death funnel. I'm hoping the alarm doesn't go off. If the alarm doesn't go off, we're in business. Because this is the outskirts. We aren't. We haven't even gotten got in. To the castle yet <laughs> to get to the prison bit of cold it's yet. Okay, seems like we're okay.
No, no alarm. No Alan this game. No. It's done. Because if Alan goes off, one of our crew, our crew members is dead. As a, like a parrot. Like a dead parrot sketch. We don't want that. Leave it to me. Can we climb over that? Can we climb over that's that? That's it. If we can, that's going to be useful. Mine. Agreed. Oh, we uh -huh. can't. Oh, I thought the, the Green Beret would be able to do that, surely. Mine. I mean, you think you would, wouldn't you? It's a small enough wall to just get over there, just, you know, flip. Break into here and find out what's in here. Or to move around, kill him off. Before he arrives. Okay, so. Question is, how do we do we get him over to him? Yeah, because until he's dead, we can't really move that guy over, over there. I don't believe so anyway. This is a tough old mission to look at to actually get going. I mean there's so much buildings around here, you know. I'm your man. Alright, wham. Jesus. Hmm. I see. All right. Uh huh. Bum, bum, ba, da, bum. Ha ha. Oh no. Four. Done. I think I may have wasted some bullets there, so I'm not going to do that like that. Because I'm going to need some bullets. The guy on the bridge that walks over the bridge and the one up on that tower. Because we need them around the perimeter dead, so then they're not going to raise the alarm when we go in. I like this. Not a shot. That was a shot that didn't count. <laughs> yeah. Or what I should have done was two gunships through time. <laughs> I like that.
I mean, there's just no way I'm going to run over there and actually kill him before he gets to them, you know, and pick up these bodies so he doesn't see. Oh. That's all right, I'll just do that. <laughs> no doubt. <laughs> I like this. Let's see whether this guy comes down. He doesn't, that's good, right? Done. Many of these guys are snipers and, you know, they're not, but I can take the German rifle. He's handy for that. What's the next target? All right. I mean, you'd think for something like that, they would do something, but like you got a team of snipers just one, one, one direction, one, one other direction, and then just like start picking them off. I like this. Over here. What's the next target? Village there. I was just picked off there. It's a bit cheeky looking around, looking around for other things and getting picked off like that. That's, that's, that's disgraceful behaviour. What's going on? I like that. It was that fucker there. It was actually one of those buggers, actually. I like this. Kill this guy off because we may have to take a couple of these out like here and here and up there but we'll see because that may have been them no doubt yeah it was him I like this. Okay. Haha. <laughs> I want to see if there's anything in here. There may be something in there. No doubt. Okay. Right. Because he needs to die by this. Anyway, that's that's the main bit. This guy, well, if we take this this guy out, we may we may be able to get him another way. But the next person needs to go is him. So let's do that. No doubt. Ha <laughs> ha. Done. Ha ha. Because surely I can see him there. 
What's the next target? I like that. I like this. Lovely. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha. Is he on top of the wall or is he behind it? No doubt. No doubt. Ha ha. Done. I was on top. There we go. Okay. Fine. Now we can look at these okay. guys in peace. Oh, no, there we go. Hmm. Now we can. <laughs> What's the next target? Right, let me look hmm. at these two guys in peace. <laughs> In here, it's going to be fun, though, isn't it? Um, game. What's the next target? There we go. Uh huh. Okay. Game's glitched. I see. All right. Game bloody glitched on us. Because all my bits were gone, my HUD disappeared, it wasn't coming back on, it wasn't allowing me to look at anything. No doubt. I like that. <sighs> hmm. Bad game. Bad. Naughty game. Done. Yes. Okay. Done. Done, da dun dun dun. All right. Hmm. Ha <laughs> ha. Good job, really nothing there. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Got ya. Uh huh. This game is too easy to, to glitch out, though, unfortunately.
because if you noticed during the last game, the last mission, there were some bits I couldn't actually look in. Yes. Hmm. That'd be a pub. But if that's Germans in there. What's the next target? Okay. Alright, so we saved it there, that's fine. Now we've got to get him killed, and then we can see about starting to make our way in and getting the uniform over to our guy there which may be him a better uniform for the for the disguise because if we get the, the I like that the disguised over to our other mate ha -ha. then we should be fine uh-huh What's the next target? Good. Good, good, good. Right. Good, good, good. Like it. That's fine. So now where are we in terms of what we need to do? Because ideally we need to clear him out. Right, so you're there. Get him dead, go around these two. Him dead, him dead. Get sniper guy. Ah! Okay, they just turned up there. I'm ready. Aha. Aha. Why did they just turn up and where did they come from? Aha. He would have seen the sniper dead. because when he comes back around he's going to have himself a slight case of death here because he's going to come around past here isn't he well, that's fine You're off for the night. No worries, dude. Thank you so much for being here. Well, we've got another about 20 odd minutes, so yeah, we should have. We should have some good progress. I mean, if I can clear this area out, this little area out of, you know, the Nazi scumbags, then that's a good night for us. Then we can work next week on actually 
getting the codes, getting my guy out of there, and then on to the final mission. Yeah, I said that right. We could be on to the final mission of, of Commandos 2. Alarm! As long as he goes back to doing his, his, his usual bit. Wherever you come from. Right away, sir. Moin. Good. Take your bits there. I believe that was that, that was not the guy that was around here. It certainly looks like it though. There's a way in. Is there a way in there? Can we get in that way? No, we can't. Well, it's not electrified. That's good. Okay. Right away, sir. This is very, very strategic on this part, isn't it? Piece of cake. Okay. What I am going to do is going to put the R bit round here. She comes down, I'm hiding here. Boom. They don't see. Piece of cake. Obviously, if we can get these two out of the way, like from from, then that's fine. But I don't believe I have any. No, I don't have any cigarettes to move them out of the way yet. This is mine. Shitter, wasn't it? He's out. He was out of range for that. Leave it to me. I'm going to try again one more time to see if he will come down from there when he moves along.
Leave it to me. All right, yes, yeah, sir. How you doing, man? Mine. Aha. Right. That's good to hear, not too bad. That's good to hear. Right away, sir. Done. Let's uh, make sure we're in a position to not be stupid. Leave it to me. Mine. Mine. Now we have smokes. Can't carry any more. Okay. I can't carry any more. Why not? Fine. Agreed. A green beret you can't carry anymore. Done. Bullshit. That's what I say to there. Right away, sir. Aha. Uh -huh. I went to do some post mod stuff. We see we're still in the greenhouse. We are, but there's less bad guys around. Leave it to me. Mine. Like so. Leave it to me. Mine. I mean, we also got rid of the um, the sniper bits up over the other side, so the sniper's doing well. Now it's this guy and this floaty bastard round here. Right away, sir. Aha. Uh -huh. Mine. I'll get him when he comes back so this guy doesn't see him. So yeah, we, we are making progress, we're clearing them out. Which is really good, because next week that means we can actually start to really push in. Leave it to me. Thank you very much. This is mine. What else? You don't have that much. Okay, right. Agreed. So yeah, Sniper is doing rather well. He is yes. over here. There's guys in there, but I'm not going into it. Sniper's taking these guys out. So he he's on his way to get into here. We could probably take him out without too much trouble now. But we've also get up, we've got to get up there and kill him. 
which we can do. So then that's that area, little area cleared. We've got to watch these two up here because painting and that. So yeah, we're still not in Castle Colditch yet, but we're making progress to get into it, you know? Because I'm guessing... The entrance... Yeah, there's the entrance to Castle Colditch there, so we're going to have to go through here. So we're going to have to kill him. That's okay, we can do that. Another guy's in there, so we don't need to worry about him too much. We can get him a uniform. But we're on our way. It's gonna, this is going to take a longer period. I think this, is gonna, this one might take three streams. But we'll see. We will see. We will see. I'm ready. Piece of cake. But I think uh -huh. we've made a good start on it, you know. Aha. Uh -huh. This is mine. I mean, especially the fact now, if we look at the map, the map's like cleared out mostly at the bottom. Like around here, there's a lot of it cleared out. I mean, you've got this bit cleared out, you got this bit cleared out. We just have to clear this now to get him active and mobile. And then around here, so we can get in to get these. But yeah, not bad, not bad. Right. Piece of cake. Now, matey bum cakes, how are we going to get you? I think I know. Leave it to me. I'm hopeful we can be on okay. Commandos 3 by April. I don't, I don't see why not, but you never know. Right away, sir. <laughs> oh, you know it's going to. Leave it to me. Well, let him see that. We just know it's going to, mate. It, it, I thought the other one was going to do it. The other mission was... Like Abdullah said, you know. Piece of cake. Mine. That's fine. Don't really need anything from him. Uh, the good thing is, this is not a blow the shit out of him for ambition, you know. Now, how are we going to it's get done. you? Because we kill him off. We take this guy out, and this guy out, and that's the Green Beret and the Sniper joined up. Here's your cake. Right away, sir. Aha. Mine. Aha. Let's kill this guy. Mine. Mine. 
Yeah, we gotta kill him as well now. We're doing good. We are doing very, 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 very good. We are. Right. So who do we go for first? You. Or you. Right away, sir. Let's go for you. Okay. Aha. Uh because -huh. the one thing I do love about this is the options you have. You don't have to do it my way. You can do it another way. This is mine. Aha. <clears throat> uh -huh. Agreed. Easy enough. Piece of cake. This is mine. Because I've seen people put down, um, you know, the, the, the decoy bit that you hear, and they bury themselves near it, so when the, the soldiers go by, they can spring up and stab them. It's quite ingenious. Right away, sir. Agreed. Uh, it's, again, save it here because then we don't have to piss about constantly with it. Leave it to me. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> Leave it to me. <laughs> right. That's Don't. one side done. Me? I like that. All right. I do I like that. So it's such a pity that we don't have like a grappling hook or anything to hook up to here and then go on in to the to cold it's that way. Right. Okay, let's go. Now we have to tackle the, the, the bit of getting him across. How are we going to do this? We're going to have to go the long way round, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to have to go this way round to get to the church to get... Yeah, okay.
Fine. Stay out of my way. It's about half of the perimeter is done. Which is good. We got what, a couple of minutes left. Oh no, so. wait, sir. Come on. Yeah. Okay. Right away, sir. Didn't go according to plan. <laughs> but on that note, that's what we'll call it. <laughs> there was your curveball. Right. <laughs> I want to thank everybody for tonight. I want to thank Ad Hawkins, Maelstrom Alpha, and Corn for the raids. Thank you very much for that. It's been wonderful having your company, whether you've lurked or not. I will not call you lurking out because lurkers are the lifeblood of streams. And they make you feel may you feel doing something right as well. But yeah, so I will be back uh, Sunday. Sunday morning for Bayonetti. Starting that one. And then Sunday afternoon, I believe we're going to be doing the podcast. But as it's Mothering Sunday, I may not be part of it. We'll have to see. Anyway. Your company has been wonderful. Thank you so much. We're going to head off. I'm not going to do a raid because I, the only thing I have to do is go for a poo. Which is t probably TMI, but you know what? When you have bowel problems like I do, nothing is these days. So you take care. I'll see you Sunday morning. Yeah, Sunday morning. You have a good night. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.